S7. Sniper available. Double kill. We have the ball. Ball dropped. Oh, I'm so good at that jump now. Oh my god, I'm so good at it now. Shredded. This Kedor jump is sick, man. I finally got it pretty consistent, and I've been using it a lot in Season 4. It is still very difficult to do. Oh, so this is now the only way to do it as well. The classic ghost jump method of hitting this jump no longer works. As of Season 4, 343 made some ch uh, changes to collision on either the Spartan or the map, and ghost jumping no longer works in the game. Other jumps have changed sort of as well, like on Bazaar, for example, the placement of like where you're landing has changed. It's difficult to explain. I'm gonna try my best to explain how I hit this one though, because this is not a ghost jump. There is a physical ledge on the outer edge of the right side of this doorway here, and you have to pinpoint land on it and jump off of it to clamber up to the sandbag here. In order to land on it, you have to like intimately understand the size of it and where it is though. Because if you're off by even the slightest amount, you're not actually going to land and connect with this physical ledge here. So I have a process to hitting this. I start by standing on the right side of this panel. So I give myself some space. I hold crouch and I jump from a crouch position. This gives me a low altitude jump. I release crouch in the air. So I'm in a stand position in the air. And that ensures that I hit this ledge as early as possible with the least amount of downward momentum. I want to very gently land on this ledge. The landing point that I'm aiming for is what makes this jump so tricky. It's a tiny little ledge and it's not connected with the wall as well. I find that if I actually jump and try to push into the wall to line it up, I don't hit this. It's even harder to hit. You need to really pin. I'll try to actually screenshot specifically like where I'm visualizing landing. The rest of it's going to kind of be up to you. My trick really is to jump from that crouch position straight up and then after jumping, I very gently fade forward on the left control stick and ensure that my landing is exactly on that pinpoint spot I need to land. I don't ever touch the wall before getting to that spot, if that makes sense. But there is no like one true method of lineup. You just have to keep jumping at it gently until you can find that perfect fade forward into that tiny ledge. It's actually possible to stand on it too and just sit there and potentially skip your clamber. With a lot of practice, you can get this down. I think it's better than the ghost jump method. 